What's up YouTube, this is Printed ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to downgrade from iOS 10.0 back to 9.3.2. So let's show you guys that I'm on iOS 10.0. Right there, 10.0. So, things you're going to need, you're going to need a firm, a copy of your firmware. The way I'm going to do this, I'm going to do it and everything that's on your device will stay on your device. Now, you won't lose anything, we're just going to update. We're gonna hit shift update and you should be fine. So this is the new iOS 10. I mean everything right there, iOS 10. And we're gonna download our firmware. So I'm gonna have a link in the description with this website right here. You're gonna to go to it. You're gonna click right here. Maybe all that. You're gonna click right here on all the firmware you got. All the devices and all the firmware should show up right here. I'm on I got my iPhone 5S right here, GSM. So I got it right here. If you got the global version, but everything you need should be right here. Then you're just gonna click on whichever one and then you're gonna hit download right here. So let's exit out of that. Let's exit out of that and zoom out. Let's open up iTunes. You can see I have my device right there. And it says 10.0. And what we're gonna do? What we're gonna do is we're gonna hit Shift Update because we want to keep everything on our device. Everything that's on this device, we want to keep on there. So it's gonna hit Shift Update. Obviously, the device gotta be plugged in. So we're gonna hit Shift Update. If you're on if you're on Windows, if you're on Mac, you're gonna hit Option Update and then it will prompt you to search for the wherever you um, have this firmware saved so I got it on my desktop so I just click on it see 9.3.2 so I hit open and it's gonna ask us if we want to update to that firmware we're gonna hit update I'm just gonna let it do its thing see right up here it's, it's going along smoothly keep your device plugged in doesn't have to be at the lock screen but uh, and this could take a couple of minutes guys so I'm gonna be back when this is done So basically we're almost done now. The major part is over. It's just gonna do a, a reboot and we should be up and running. So we cancel, we're gonna start to unlock. Put in my password. It's gonna reboot. This part shouldn't take that long guys. So, as you can see, we got our lock screen back, our slide to the left, and we get our thing right there. Boom, and we're in. Got everything still on my device. No more iOS 10. No more iOS 10. Let's go to settings, general, about version. Not now. 9.3.2 and that's how you downgrade from iOS 10 back to the most current firmware 9.3.2 if you don't like iOS 10 so if it's crashing whatever your your reason is if you want to downgrade from iOS 10 back to 9.3.2 that's how you do it and you keep all your stuff on your phone do not just do the restore version because it's gonna restore everything you're gonna have to start brand new just download a firmware from the links in the description and then hit the shift or option update and just do it manually like that and you should be good sprint today tp 101 rate comment and definitely subscribe for more videos like this peace thanks for watching